Andrew Tate. He's bombastic and a certified jerk, but I get that's his shtick and it seems to be working for him, so whatever. And now that he's no longer banned on Twitter, he's using his longer leash to troll the perpetually triggered. He picked Swedish teen climate activist Greta Thunberg. The two exchanged Twitter barbs after Tate tweeted this, and Greta responded with what amounts to a dick joke. But then a very predictable thing happened. The liberal Twitter warriors got all in a tizzy. The perpetually offended get to do and say whatever they want. They get to cancel others for no reason beyond words offending them, and then voila, their will is done. And furthermore, the reason people like Andrew Tate have a following at all is because they say the things many people are thinking but are too afraid to say, but then they add their shock jock spin on it and take it way too far. Yet we still eat it up because we're so desperate for realness, we'll take it, even if it's coming from a misogynistic turd like Andrew Tate. So let it be our collective New Year's resolution to stop letting not only the meek, but also the loudmouth jackasses control the world.